Hello and welcome to this edition of Chewing the Fat. I'm Andy Lehman and so today I want to talk about a quote that I saw that I th really resonated with me the other the other day. So this might be a very short Chewing the Fat, it's not going to be particularly long, but there was a, a quote and I can't remember who the quote was by so um, <laughs> I apologise if it sounds like I'm making it up but it's not actually. It was a quote, I read it on Facebook, it was shared by a copywriter and what was said resonated with me. It, it sort of it hit a chord, it rang a bell in my head, and I found this very, it's a, it's a very powerful truth to this, something that you should probably think about with your marketing, and that was, it said that people do not need advice, they need encouragement, <clears throat> and I thought that was great, because as a product creator who has created products for several people, myself, I've sold products to other people, you can lay out everything in one of the, in a video course or in a blueprint, you could lay out every step that is needed to build a business or do something specific, but the chances are very few people will actually go on and do everything and complete the whole steps and they'll create an online business or whatever it is or create a product from the product, even though you've outlined everything, there will be 80-90% of the people will not even finish the course, will not finish the reading the PDF, they will not get done what you say. It doesn't matter how much you outline and lay it all out for them, they won't do it. Online digital courses or digital course or courses in particular, home study courses, are renowned for their large, I won't say failure rate, it's completion rate. Um, so if you did, if you sold a hundred places, you would have a hundred people buy your course. Ninety of those people probably never finish the course. Out of the ten who do, two or three may actually do the work that was needed uh, and get somewhere like. So basically, it can be quite a high failure rate. So the the saying I don't know if I, I can't remember if I've told you the saying or not what I read. But it said basically that people do not need advice; they need encouragement. And this I found very interesting because this is something that with encouragement or when you're talking to people one to one, when you've got an accountability buddy, those people are keeping you going. They're encouraging you and they can be saying, yes, oh, you know, if you're having a rough time, because a lot of people who are working from home, a lot of the people who are trying to build an online business, sometimes their partners, you know, their girlfriends, wives, husbands, their family do not understand what they're doing. They don't know what they're doing. They have no understanding of what they're doing. You know, the work that's involved and so they cannot necessarily be encouraging they don't necessarily know and sometimes some family members are like why don't you just give that up or it's not going to work they can be quite negative and that way you don't want to speak to them at least when you have an accountability buddy you are being encouraged all the way you have somebody to talk to so you have someone to talk about the problems the issues that you're having and if you are talking to somebody um, who already knows what you're doing they can also advise but they can help but while you're doing this talking to him that is actually active encouragement now this has got me thinking because i've been watching a lot of the online high ticket affiliate marketers the coaching the mentors all these type of people in fact i'm having a bit of a mentoring session with a person at the moment and it's interesting because i'm finding out that when you are talking to somebody live one-to-one -one, sort of like you're talking to me in this video if you're talking to somebody live each week about something it's actually rather encouraging. It keeps you actively focused on what you are doing. And they are able to speak through any problems and issues that you have. You don't feel that you are alone. You don't feel that you are doing this. You're not trying to climb a mountain on your own. You have a team with you or you have somebody else with you. You have somebody who's basically cheering you on. And I find that actually is where a lot of the power of the mentoring and the coaching courses come from. A mentor and a coach is great because they can teach you all the information. They've done the work. They teach you what they know. They can show you. They can advise you. And that's great. But they could actually just lay that all out into a packaged mentoring course, which is a series of videos or a PDF. They could write it in a book. But with the online one-to-one -one phase or the group coaching calls, so like on a weekly basis where you join in on a live Zoom chat with about 10 15 other people and your mentor, your coach, or you do one-to-one. -one. When you do that weekly, the power is not necessarily in what they are telling you. It is the fact that you are talking to somebody who is encouraging you to carry on. And I think that's where the value is in, in with a lot of mentoring and coaching courses, as well as all the information, the knowledge, the expertise, and you know them being able to show you and tell you what they did. 
They can keep you on the right track. They can keep you encouraged. They can keep you carrying on. And when you keep on keeping on, that is where you will find most of the power. That is... People give up far too easily these days. They don't give in. They don't, <clears throat> they don't try and, they don't compete. They don't complete what they are supposed to be doing. They don't get finished. They, they quit far too soon. And when they do that, they are not going to get the results that they want or they deserve. And the reason why majority of people quit too early is because as the, as the going gets too tough, they don't have anybody who's cheering them on. They don't have anybody who's applauding them for their efforts so far, what they have done. They do not have anybody who has technically, effectively got their back. And so they do not have the drive to carry on because there's, it's very hard and lonely when you're trying to do things by yourself. So when you have encouragement, then you are, <clears throat> you're accelerated, you're catapulted to, um, towards your sort of destined destination, your goal, whatever it is that you're working towards, you feel compelled to carry on because you have somebody there who is sort of cheering you on. And, um, and so when I read that quote where he basically said that people do not want advice, they want encouragement, I thought, yes, I get that. That's where a lot of the coaching and mentoring is coming from. So when people are paying for mentoring, when they're paying for coaching, when they have a one-to-one -one call with somebody each week or when they are talking to somebody, even whether it's through WhatsApp or through Facebook Messenger, when they are talking to a group mentoring, when there's when they're with other people, when, you, when you're with like a mastermind circle and you've got five or six people all talking about the same thing, You've got people who are sharing their failures, they get sharing their successes, and they are able to say, I did this and I did this. Oh, you have this problem, this is what I did. I had the same problem, so I can do this. And all these people are talking to each other. You feel like, you feel like you're not alone. You feel like encouraged to carry on and do what you really basically wanted or was hoping to get done in the first place. <clears throat> so I found this very... <clears throat> excuse me. I found this very very interesting that yeah people do not need advice they need encouragement uh, and so with that in mind i have in many ways i mean I, I was going to say i've changed my mind about mentoring and coaching i did start out many years ago i started to learn a lot about websites through what is i suppose effectively was a mentoring coaching course i was a each month a new module was released and it was a series of videos in pdf and i studied that and then they release these videos into the um, to the course each month, where they spoke to them on the phone, and they just sort of said, "Now this is what's happening this month." Blah blah. blah. So it was mentoring and coaching, and I do believe that mentoring and coaching, or learning, investing in yourself, and getting education and learning skills and skill sets, is basically going to take you from where you are now to somewhere completely different. It's got me out of certain jobs. You know, I invested in myself. I learnt sets of skills. I've learnt sets of um, information. I've got so much in my head that I've learned. I've paid for. I've I have spent several thousand pounds, dollars over the years learning education, uh, learning what I know. And it's taken me from factories. It's taken me off building sites. It's taken me off the tools as a joiner. It's put me into different positions. It's worked. I'm now working remotely as a freelance writer and a product creator for a couple of big information publishers in the UK. I have worked for in the offices for a big information publisher in the UK. I am now living in Portugal, potentially thinking of moving elsewhere. And I've done all this because I've learned these skills. I invested in myself. And I will say I have done this a lot of the time without the encouragement of a mentor or coach even though I've taken on other courses I've not actually had the one-to-one -one specifically but I have had family who have backed me I've had the encouragement from other places but I've also had the determination and the drive to make sure that I escape from what I was doing but I do believe that the mentoring and coaching courses I mean it's taken me a long time and that's the point it's taken me a long time to get to where I am but with mentoring and coaching when you've got somebody who's your back when someone is giving you the encouragement that you need, you are going to get to your destination a lot quicker. Because as we as we found out, as we well know, that you can give everybody all the information that they need, but very few will do that. And it's not because the information is poor. I truly believe it's because they are not getting the encouragement that they need. So weekly, daily, monthly encouragement from a mentor, from a course, from a friend, from an accountability buddy is basically going to help you out a lot. 
So yeah, so I'm going to bring this edition of Chewing the Fat to a close. It's a short 10 minute version, but I just wanted to say that if you are going to start trying to build a business online or do something, change some skills, learn some new skills, invest in yourself, whatever it is, try and get somebody, whether it's a mentor, whether it's a coach, whether it's a friend, whether it's somebody who's doing the same stuff, an accountability buddy, get somebody who can help you and encourage you on your journey. Because as we've just found out, this quote that resonated with me, I can't remember who said it, but they did say it's what people need is encouragement, not advice. They don't need advice, they need encouragement. And that is very, very powerful. So on that note, I'm going to say thank you very much for watching. I'm Andy Lehman and I shall speak to you again soon in the next edition of Chewing the Fat. Thank you and goodbye.